Hey guys and welcome back to game but today we are playing in Old War Town of Minion Rush with Made Minion and it's level 787 residential area map with double objective mission so we need to smash 250 frozen objects and jump over obstacles 290 times so we are ready let's run and I'm gonna try and get multiplayer only for the jump overs because of you know that made minion by default will find more freeze rays than the other runner so I believe that uh, that way we complete this task soon. Uh, today is 9th of February and we already recorded uh, two videos. One of them was Subway Surfers. It was a uh, new challenge with a Carmen new outfit. It was carnival outfit and etc. Uh, and the uh, second video was in the uh, Minion Rush. Of course, we played with the Tortilla Chip at Minion and he completed a uh, very, very interesting near misses task with UFO props and minigames of course it was previous level now with made minion we are gonna record a uh, second video in the old version and of course after there will be new version and the new special mission house of flying minions with uh, how many days in it uh 13 days in it uh, of course with the version 980 with the newest runners like the zodiac bob and after there will be daily boss battle like yesterday we defeated miena with the uh, uh, Cupid Minion. Uh, so probably Cupid now defeated all four bosses and it's time to uh, play with the next outfit. Uh, so within four days I think uh, if there is no such video there will be four boss battles with the upcoming runner. Anyways now let's talk about the uh, this exact run because of you see that it's not easy task at all even though we have recommended runner multiplayer perks uh, two times multiplayer for the jump overs you see we are still trying to get the first route and yes it's obvious it's double objective mission and these are highest levels we almost reached 800 levels so we have to do our best and collect as many fruits as possible to expand the jelly lab again Okay, we failed, but uh, it's not a big deal because of previous runner. It was Tortilla Chip Hat Minion. He failed probably uh, 10 times or sort of. It was near Mrs. Task, and that's why. But now our main minion will try and avoid it because of we have only three uh, revives. We can use it four times, and after we have to use the switch runner with the bananas or revive her with the tokens. So just give up failing and avoid all these obstacles. Uh, so yes, you know how double objectives work, so I'm gonna quickly describe it. Double objective means that you have two missions combined in one. First line, first one just simply wants to break through the object with the freeze ray and second one wants jump over. Uh, until you complete one of them, uh, you will not get progress for the uh, second fruit. So we have to complete both of these objectives to get first fruit. Otherwise, you're gonna uh, make more and more jump overs uh, without wasting uh, time and without viewers and yes it will be pointless so i will show it to you once we complete first line uh, the progress for that we will stop in the case if you uh, don't complete second one but to be honest uh, now i think that uh, we are in a big trouble even though we have a uh, recommended runner for the freeze race you see that we completed jump over task almost uh, and uh, there is still uh, so many frozen objects left and to be honest it's really annoying because of we activated three or four freeze rays already uh, and we get only 45 frozen objects so i have to focus on it and i should make more and more breakthroughs with a freeze ray uh, anyways let's just continue the run 114 116 118 and you see it's completed and it's pointless uh, to make any more jump overs because of you see that it will not rise and it will not increase until you uh, feel the first line first objective with a freeze ray so let's do this and let's avoid even the jump overs because of as i said there will not be a reason to try and uh, perform them until you complete the freeze ray task Okay, it's 
secretary and Frieza is not working any longer but okay now it's gonna be back and here we go to be honest once we completed the uh, second objective and we focused on the freeze ray did you see that with three uses we only gained 45 uh, frozen objects and with the uh, fourth use with only one activation uh, we added about 40 or sort of so come on let's do this because of oh my god i know i knew that we are gonna fail but anyway still three more freedom wives left in here and i think that uh, probably they will be enough by the way performing near misses is pointless because of you don't have the rechargeable bonus and power up and you are gonna waste some time uh, without it Okay, this is the vacuum it's completely different one and let's just think about the upcoming videos yes it's obvious that the uh, next uh, video will be daily boss battle after there will be two more videos in the new version and maybe we even record uh, one more video the sixth video in the minion rush so let's try and let's do this more videos equals to more fun more levels and more entertaining so yes it's gonna be good uh, and everything we ask for is uh, if you really enjoyed the videos like them subscribe to us and write in the comments uh, what you like what you didn't like what you changed and so on okay 109 frozen objects and i believe that first fruit will be enough for us because of um, yes it's obvious that this double objective and it's really really hard so let me get one more bonus and power up and i hope that it will be the last one because of you see that there are 109 obstacles and i don't really think that we need more than 40 otherwise there will be uh, probably 150 frozen objects and it's gonna uh, require two more freeze rays and it's gonna be really really uh, big trouble for the main minion okay let's go and let's build this now you know that uh, we have the evil minion i can quickly activate it by just paying some tokens but uh, it's gonna give us a breakthrough object that's the cable actions but in the task you see it was uh, about freeze ray to freeze and break through the object so evil minion will not work and i don't really want to waste some tokens so now let's focus on the run we are gonna grab only the freeze rays and i will avoid everything all the elf like for example the mega minions i saw it uh, but it's not time for that bonus and power up and finally i think that this freeze ray will be more than enough to get uh, the first fruit and the first objective completed so come on main minion you can do this please i know you're strong and you got all the skills and powers but unfortunately 138 frozen objects and we need only six more no 12 more because of the multiplayer doesn't apply on the you know, freeze race task but anyways it's gonna be soon done and yes i think that it's enough for today guys so thanks for watching stay tuned stay safe we love you and wish you everything best so see you later bye bye Okay, no way, there is a red crosses and the red zones area, so I didn't really expect that, but okay, it's happening. Okay, that's really, really good, but uh, you know, I was about to finish the run, I even said goodbye and stopped uh, talking about the run, but okay, this is perfect. Okay, what, what just happened? I didn't see any obstacles 
to avoid. So why did I fail? I can't really explain it. Okay, it's really hard. Oh, it's impossible. It's impossible to survive in this horrible place. So you see that we're starting from the very beginning to complete all these objects. And come on, I don't really see what is end. Okay, this is hard. This is really, really hard and impossible. Oh, the good news is that now we respawned into the middle. And I hope that that way we complete this task. To be honest, this is the uh, scariest thing in the old version because of these red crosses and the red zones are really hard to fight and beat. So yes, it's done, it's completed and again. Goodbye.